This lab that you're looking at is MOCA, an Emotion Capture and Analysis Lab. We're in the process of building a system which captures three-dimensional surfaces, primarily of humans, moving. And it has a variety of different uses. We are interested in applications of computer graphics, primarily for medical applications. We are in the process of building a simulator for performing endotracheal intubation for neonates, which is a very difficult procedure because the child is so small. Just like flight simulators are used to train pilots, uh, we are making these simulators that train physicians to perform especially difficult procedures. I designed the whole system and uh, provide the solutions for particular problems and also figure out the research direction. Computer graphics is a cross-discipline subject that involves knowledge from mathematics, physics, optics, and engineering. Uh, where I use multiple connects to capture the close-range depth image of the human body, we take totally eight phases and uh, we set a angle of the meshes. We build up a 3D human body using non-rigid registration. Whenever I make the algorithm works, I can see it vividly on the screen. And that is something that makes me feel good about it. You want to have passion for what you do. So find something that you're passionate about. And especially if you're interested in coming to GW, I would suggest that you contact a professor who is interested in a field that's similar in an area that uh, you have interest in. Talk to them and make these personal connections. So in the Cloud Systems Research Lab here at GW, uh, we're focusing on very large scale computer systems. So when we talk about the cloud, we really mean hundreds of thousands or even millions of computers that are spread around the world, uh, but that together form some big applications. And our research group is looking at ways to manage these systems to make them more efficient, make them more reliable, or provide them better security than they would have otherwise. We have a cluster of about 50 computers here, and we use these to develop uh, new software infrastructures to manage these types of computer clusters. In our projects, we build it on the hypervisor and we are trying to look inside into the guest virtual machines uh, memory or hard disk to detect potential attacks. Once we detect those attacks, we can prevent the attack from happening. We are trying to protect operating systems running inside operating systems called virtualization on, in computers. So yeah, if you really want to work with awesome faculty, this is a really good place to come to and study.